Hey guys, this is your boy Kenneth with my co-host. We got Rika Ranger and Drew Danger over here. We're doing our second episode of the podcast of The Order. And we do have a special guest here, Viking Samurai. We're going to get into some good old content with him and also ask him some great questions about martial arts. Power Rangers, if he's a Power Ranger fan like we are, we're going to get into some nerdy stuff today. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn it over to my boy Drew, let him introduce the Viking Samurai, and we're going to get into some good questions here today. All right, guys. Hey, Drew Danger here. I just want to say I want to welcome my brother, the Viking Samurai. Not Viking Samurai, the Viking Samurai. (laughs) He is a legend. He just won his first professional fight, killed it. And nice. you had the gold representing some Rocky Balboa there on your shorts, man, which was cool. And nice. he is a martial art extraordinaire, the up and coming action star we've been waiting for for 30 years. <laughs> He's right. changed the world. I'm telling you guys, this guy, he is the it guy, and he is a good friend and a brother. And always, man, in Christ, in martial arts, and in life, I want to welcome the Viking Samurai. And it's Thanks, a pleasure guys. to have you here, my friend. Rika, do you want to say anything before we get into some questions? I mean, what an for intro, you? right? I mean, crazy. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I just got I just got put onto the channel um, a couple of days ago. I've been kind of consuming the content, checking it out, and uh, definitely the real deal, bro. I was impressed by everything so i'm digging the whole 80s vibe you know the old action stars oh, that type man. of vibe you know and cool channel cool stuff so oh thanks man yeah yes. and we're gonna make sure to get all your information so everybody can go and check out all your content on your youtube wherever they can find you yeah we'll get all I'm that from you so they here, can go man. ahead and do that for you we for will sure, be promoting man. you we will be promoting <laughs> oh thanks and, and thanks no for that problem. Intro, really so what we're going to do uh, before we get into our questions we're going to let Vi- the excuse me the viking samurai introduce himself and give us a little background about himself then we're going to lead in with drew to give us some good, you know to start off with some good questions so viking if you don't mind let telling the audience about yourself Oh, hey guys. So I'm the Viking Samurai. Started the YouTube channel back in September of 2019. And I'm a lifetime martial artist and natural bodybuilder, by the way. So I started training seriously in 1993 and I never stopped. Of course, I grew up watching the 80s and 90s action and martial arts films. Stallone, Schwarzenegger, Seagal, Van Damme, all those guys. Love those movies. They motivated me. They inspired me. And yeah, I'm I'm part of like the renaissance of kind of bringing these back because the last Kumite, which you guys can pre-order on Amazon, by the way, is coming out <laughs> pretty soon, uh, nice. June 11th in the U.S. It's coming out next month in Europe, and it's a throwback. It's an homage to to Bloodsport and a lot of these other films like Kickboxer. You know, I give the producer Sean David a ton of credit for putting that together. It was a passion project, and I was very happy to be invited and participate in it. And he had a couple of YouTubers involved, like the editor was Oliver Harper. And then, of course, uh, some people don't know, but Sean David is a huge YouTuber. He covers basketball, but like the 80s and 90s basketball, like Michael Jordan, Dennis Rodman, Larry Bird. So he kind of does something um, similar to what I do. I'm all about the 80s, 90s action martial arts films. And right. uh, he does that with basketball. He, he also interviews a lot of these martial art legends, too. So what's really unique about my channel is I just needed a creative outlet. Like I was working in the financial industry. I'm kind of interested in the financial industry, but also it's kind of boring. So I needed a creative outlet. So I wanted to just, you know, create a YouTube channel and talk about my passions. And funny enough, it led to just talking about this stuff. And then people had reached out to me uh, because they wanted to be interviewed on the channel. So for example, like I covered a, a specific Steven Seagal story and there was a stuntman, Stephen Lambert, who unfortunately passed away. But that was my first interview. And he was telling the truth about that story related to Gene LaBelle. It's kind of um, a crazy story. But anyway, he was a witness to that. And I had signed up for like a Zoom account thinking, okay, I'll, I'll interview one guy. Sounds interesting. I want to get to the bottom of that story once and for all. And then I was going to cancel my Zoom account. But then other people was like, hey, you know, uh, your channel is kind of cool. Uh, I'd want to do an interview and I want to do an interview. 